the morning of Tuesday, June 13, 2023, we are at the residence of the chairman of the Social Democratic Front, SDF. Militants of the party are streaming in in tears. I want to say don't keep him for shame, buddy. I want to bring you say don't keep him for shame, buddy. Hey, 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 the flag of the Republic of Cameroon and that of the party is at half mass. This in confirmation of the passing away of the national chairman Ni John Frunzi on Monday, June 12, 2023, in Yaoundé, after a prolonged illness as indicated by the party authorities. We, the members of the SDF, we are received the news with a lot of uh, uh, grief because we didn't expect it to happen at this time. Considered by many as the father of democracy in Cameroon, Nijon Frunzi, despite the tension, launched the Social Democratic Front in 1990 and actively took part in the 1992 elections. Frunzi of Cameroon has run the race of democracy looking for someone to help him. A county of Northwest said, Father, yeah, yeah. Oh, Father, oh, Father, send me. Frony, the captain, I counted the vanguard as on the wise man calling you. Oh, oh, my friends, let us go now with the run. Our Father is calling you. Oh, oh, my friends, let us go now with the run. Father is calling you. I enjoyed his way of doing things, managing the political party like the SDF for all this while. He has been a wonderful person who brought democracy into Cameroon. You can remember that those who were born that time in the 90s, nobody could venture for multipartism. But he braved the odds. The military might that was brought into Bamenda, he braved it and went ahead and launched the party. And in the final analysis, the regime in power accepted multipartism through pressure. When I say pressure, it's because when they were launching, people were killed for launching the SDF. So the single party system was totally changed into multipartism because of the SDF and because of the leadership of Nijon Furundi. Thunder, the national chairman, is the father of democracy in the country, in Cameroon, because uh, after he launched the SDF in 1990, it is after that that uh, you of the press, you could even express yourself. Because before 1990, there was no freedom of press, there was no freedom of expression. Ni John Fundi acted as an inspiration for many to dare into politics. He was somebody who was so steadfast fast in what he wants to do if he wants to do something he wants to do something let it be perfect he does not want to do something haphazardly and so that taught me a lesson that when you are going out to do something either you do it well or you don't do it well we have missed him a lot in the political arena of this country but i just hope that what he left undone we, the party members, were going to walk in that line in order to liberate Cameroonians from their sufferings. The Bible even says that 70 years we have, 80 we, if we are strong. The national chairman of the Social Democratic Front has died at the age of 82. We just want to thank God for his life here on earth. And also to say that there's no perfect human being. We are all human. He might have made mistakes along the line. He might, might have smashed the toes of some other people. We just pray that those people should forgive him and God should also forgive him for whatever wrong he did on this earth and receive his soul so that he can have peace. One of the best experiences I've ever had in life was my closeness to him. He was more or less a father to me. I will forever miss him. I learned a lot getting closer to him. His death comes at a time when he was preparing to hand over the baton of command of the party to a younger person. He has trained some of us, he has mentored so many youths and uh, I believe that uh, those that are behind we are going to continue with the vision 
of uh, the national chairman, Ni Jamfrundi. Being a committed Christian and former elder of peace in Misang, the Presbyterian Secretary for Mizam South Presbytery, the Reverend Therese Uzo, in a prayer session, told the mourners that death is inevitable. While waiting for the official program of the barrier, a book has been opened for mourners to express their condolences. I am tired. 